my third grade art friends. Today is our finish day on our three-dimensional beaver. Today is the big day. We are making everything look 3D. I went ahead and cut um, our pieces out to save time on the video. So here's my head, my tail, my feet. I made some leaves, and then I have my um, log. Okay, you're gonna need a sheet of extra white paper for this video. All right, before we do the extra sheet of white paper, I want you to find your log paper. And I want you to get, grab your glue, have a pair of scissors handy today too, you might need them. Um, and I want you to, let me show you how I'm gonna roll it before I actually glue. I'm gonna roll it like this, so it's kind of like the shape of a cylinder for my log. So I'm going to take my glue, hopefully it's not clogged, and I'm going to put a little bit of glue on the edge, and I'm going to roll it, and I'm going to hold it here for a minute, because it's going to try to come undone. Hold it, hold it, hold it, okay? And then what I'm going to do after I feel like it's secure, is I'm going to put my glue on the underside of that, and then I'm going to go ahead and put my log down on the middle of my cardboard. Cardboard uh, keeps your artwork from flopping up. That's why we have a cardboard background. Okay, so there's my 3D log. My artwork's already going from two-dimensional to three-dimensional. All right, the next step, I'm going to go ahead and I am going to take my beaver tail and my head and I'm going to go ahead and glue that next. Okay, so let's do the tail, all right? And it's okay if your tail hangs off the edge of your paper, all right? Here's my tail. If you want it to be smaller, you can always trim it. Better too big than too small, okay? Now I'm going to take my head. I'm going to glue that down. We're missing part of our head, which we will work on in just a minute. So right now it kind of looks weird because we don't have his little paws. You're going to take the paws and you are going to fold it, fold it, all right, and we're going to take just a little part of it and we'll put some glue so it looks like he's holding the log. Like this. Remember, you can always rewind the video if I'm going too fast. Okay, now we want to make his face look 3D. This is where your extra paper is going to come, come in handy. All right, you are going to use your pencil and draw the shape of a rectangle. All right, and then you're going to take your uh, brown crayon marker, whatever it is that you use that matches the face. I'm going to find mine. All right, you're going to color that in. Remember, hide the paper when you color. Finish this real quick. Mine looks bumpy and has texture because my table is a little bumpy. All right, we're going to cut it out. Keep that extra paper handy. You're going to need it for a minute. All right, I cut out my rectangle. Same thing I did with my log. I'm going to roll it. Hold it there for a minute. Keep it tight. Put some glue on the other side. Add it to my face. This is going to look like it was a little snout. All right, and then with my scrap paper, I'm going to make some buck-looking teeth. All right, so I'm just cutting these two little rectangle pieces out, and you can kind of measure to figure out how big you want it to be. And then we're going to make a little nose. So here's my teeth. All right, and to do your nose, you could just do this on your scrap paper. Just go ahead and color like an oval, a heart shape, or a triangle shape. All 
and glue his nose down. Looking like a cutie. All right, and then remember I said that I did leaves. This is your job as an artist now. I don't want all your stuff to look the same. So you could do leaves, you could do flowers, you could do tree branches. I think I'll add more details than what I do in the video. But I want you to see how I fold my leaves. I fold them in half, and then I just put glue on one side, and I glue it down to make those look 3D as well. All right, go ahead and add your details. Don't forget to take a picture of your artwork and send it to me. Keep up the good work. Bye, friends.